What's up guys, Armed Atlas here, your guide into the world of firearms. So if you've been following the channel, you know that we did an everyday carry video, like an ultimate EDC guide video. And in it, we talked about the Neomag. This one is cool because it's got my name on it. And it's from Neomag. That said, super simple. You take the magnet, clip it on or stick it in your pocket so it doesn't like fall into your pocket and you're like struggling if you ever need to reload. Some people think it's stupid because they don't carry an extra mag. I think it's good to carry an extra mag because things happen and maybe you need one. So that said, um, I reached out to the guys who did the Neomag. I, I bought this with my own money and I reached out to the Neomag guys and said, hey, listen, I know you have an alias system thing. It's supposed to be like a competitor to the Enigma, which is like a, like a holster system. And I want to I want to compare the two and so they were like hey okay what, what, whatever you need we'll send it over which is awesome because I definitely want to be able to try new stuff and show you guys I'm gonna show you their alias system attached to the, to the belt first um, this is what it looks like so it attaches directly to my holster and to my belt it's like it's a bit of a middleman thing you're able to detach your holster from your belt easily I'm sure you can think of plenty of reasons why maybe you'd like to be able to take your holster off. But the cool thing is you can attach this to different mounts. Say if you want to attach it to a desk mount or something. Um, even you can have an attachment that connects directly to a tactical backpack. Those are cool. And then you can, when you want to put it back on, click just like that. It's perfect. And something else that they... Uh, they sent out, which this is the competitor to the Enigma system. When I say competitor, I asked them about it and they were like, they, they didn't position it like a competitor. They basically said, hey, we love the Enigma. We feel like there's some areas where the Enigma doesn't necessarily cover and we would like to have a product that kind of fills a lot of those gaps and maybe there's some crossover just because of the nature of it. And I think this is actually really good. I've been using it for the last few weeks very consistently, basically every single day I've been making sure I use it for a few minutes, um, doing family walks and stuff. I'm in my basketball shorts. And as I'm, you know, like kind of rush out the house, okay, everybody get ready, let's go on our walk. And uh, I don't necessarily want to put on pants. You know, I'm wearing basketball shorts, I'm wearing sweats, it's getting cold out here, I'm wearing some, some sweatpants. Does this do the trick? And I would say, yes, mostly. Uh, depending on the pants or the shorts, some shorts just don't work very well. Like if it's just too flimsy, it's just not going to work out because it uses, if you can see here, it uses the ulti clip to attach directly into the pant. And these are a little stiff, but it's good because they're not coming off. And it connects directly onto your pants. I, I'm going to actually run the gauntlet of fire. I'm going to take off this, this belt. This is my next belt. Love this belt. It's great. I'm going to take this off. I'm going to basically go directly with my gun holster on my pants with this as my belt. And um, we'll see how it goes. Let's uh, get this thing on and see kind of how it works in regards to it. Does it hold up? And hopefully you guys can kind of see like how does it hold up in actual usage because at the end of the day all this fun gear stuff doesn't matter if it doesn't actually work in regards to helping you when you need it most Cool thing is, if you uh, if there's maybe too much slack in your pants, you can kind of pull it together, and the, and the clamps kind of 
act as like a belt almost. I don't know if it's designed to do that or if that causes other problems, but feels fine right now. So, I'm gonna go through, got the uh, pack three shot timer, and you can get these linked down below, obsidiantraininggroup.com. They have the best prices on these, and free shipping if you use the discount code. So basically, Amazon. All right. Sixty one. So a little bit better than my last time. To be fair, I'm running a red dot. So I should be a little faster, but I think we can get it down to, you know, a little quite a bit lower. Um, that said, talking about the alias, um, talking about the Neomag. I don't know if you saw, but I actually did a reload from the Neomag. It works seamlessly. I'll show you, I kind of show you how that works, just in case you're, maybe you're wondering. So, guns up, guns empty, reaching in the pocket, fingers up, back in action. For those wondering, the alias, it held up from the time I went ahead and reholstered at one point um, when I drew. I don't have any issues, but I think if you wear some like khaki shorts or something like that and you don't feel like putting a belt on and the material is just strong enough, this is perfect. Absolutely perfect. I've had some kind of really flimsy basketball shorts made of like a softer material. Not so perfect. So understanding its use cases, I think you can find a lot of value in this. And, and especially that, that it can interface with the, with, the, uh, with the rest of the alias systems. So you can go from here to like a regular belt. I think that's great. You can have your, your, own, your holster as it is pretty much, just a little bit of modifications, changing out the clip. And then you go from that to this, to say you wanted to uh, have a special mount like right here and have a holster, a holster, you could have, it's kind of a, uh, how do you say? The possibilities are endless. Should you buy it? It's up to you, friend. If you have somebody, if you know somebody who has one, I recommend you try it out if you can. Just kind of see how it works or kind of at least maybe go hands on with it and see if it, if it suits you. Um, I don't know what their return policy is like if you, if you order one and you really decide you don't like it. But other than that, I, I think you should try it. Yeah, try it. You might like it.